Hey guys, Rick Switch here, and um, you could be wondering why is my hair moving? Well, I have a fan right in front of me, so. But yeah, so, anyways, I'm here with a short little video talking about how happy I am that Dolph Ziggler is number one contender for the WWE Championship. Now, I was watching SmackDown yesterday, and you know, they announced the, the, the match, the, the six man, whatever, Battle Royal, whatever you want to call it. I forgot what it was, but you know, it was Daniel Bryan and Shane McMahon choosing guys from that were like standing on the apron and then um they're like John Cena and I was like of course and then and then they're like um uh Ziggler and I'm like okay and then Bray Wyatt cool AJ Styles yeah, all right um who else was it oh yeah and Baron Corbin I'm like and then and then they're like Battle Royal they they have a Battle Royal for the like who's going to be the sixth guy in the match and Apollo Crews wins um so I mean <clears throat> Um, so I mean, I was watching the match, and I honestly was expecting Bray Wyatt to win, and I actually wanted him to win, because he was like, honestly, I didn't see Cena or Styles winning, because I figured they were going to, they're going to continue their feud through SummerSlam, or to SummerSlam, and I didn't see Dolph Ziggler winning, because I mean, the way they've been treating him for the past, like, what, three years, two years, um, and I didn't see Apollo Crews winning, because he's like a new guy, and so is Baron Corbin. So I feel like the best choice was Bray Wyatt, but to have Ziggler win, it was a it was a shock at least for me. Never kind of kind of spilled some water on me, but anyways, um, but yeah. So um, that match, uh, I mean, the match was all right, um, and Ziggler winning, I'm I was very happy to see that. I mean, Ziggler has like. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but in my opinion, like, in my time watching wrestling, um, I feel like Ziggler is, like, the, like, one of the main guys in the company currently right now that he's been pushed, and then he just gets, like, not pushed. Like, do you remember, you guys remember, he won, he, I mean, think about it, he won money in the bank, he won the belt, but you could bring up the argument that he had the concussion, and then, you know, they make him win the IC Championship, like, three times in 2014. And then in 20... It was mainly last year where he went downhill. I mean, out. I mean, it was, last year was, like, a roller coaster ride for Ziggler, I mean. He lost the majority of his views, I remember. And he, I remember he was in that long storyline with Rusev, Lot, and Summer Rae. Um, so, I mean... Now, but this is good, right? This is good. You know, they're, they're having Ziggler main event, well not main event, but they're having him at SummerSlam again for the WWE Championship against Ambrose, and I'm looking forward to this match, I mean, I'm a huge fan of Ambrose as well, um, I know, and, and this is good because, like, a lot of people like Ziggler, you know, unlike Roman Reigns, unfortunately, but a lot of people like Ziggler, so this is good, um, and, and like I said, I was really expecting, um, why to win, I didn't, I didn't, I really, I, I thought Ziggler, like, I don't know, I just, I just didn't see him winning this match, but, Unfortunately, I mean, not unfortunately, but surprisingly, they let him win, so that's good. Um, so we got three matches for SummerSlam, and we got Finn Balor versus Seth Rollins, Lesnar, Orton, and Ziggler, Ambrose. So, you know, th this this card is, is getting good. I'm just kind of like, I'm kind of pissed off about Lesnar versus Orton. Like, I love Orton, but I hate Lesnar. Um, if, you, if you haven't kept up with my channel, I, I've actually talked about Lesnar uh, like a little bit. But I mean, if you want, if you want a video on uh, why I hate Lesnar so much, you can leave on the comment section. But yeah, so um, Ziggler being number one contender is very awesome. This is very good. I'm happy that he's number one contender. Will he win? I don't know, cause Ambrose just won the belt, so they might want to keep it on him for a little bit longer. So I don't know if Ziggler's gonna win the belt. I would like for him to win the belt, but okay, we'll just have to wait and see what happens. So. Um, yeah, that's pretty much gonna wrap this up, guys. Those are just my short thoughts on Ziggler, number one, um, being number one contender. Very happy about that. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. Um, you know, this is a. I'm hoping this will be a good match. Um, you know, and yeah, I'm pretty. I, and if, it felt like the fans were satisfied with this match. From what I've seen, I've seen a little bit of reviews, and people were happy about this. So yeah, so that's all I gotta say. Um, I'll probably have at least one or two more video. One video later today, I don't know yet, but yeah. So just leave on the comment section. Do you guys are you guys happy that Ziggler's the number one contender? And until then, Reckless Rich, spinning out.